people shouldn't be handling your tarot cards, right? If you have charged your cards and designated them for your madama, your gitana, your your Indian, your ancestors, whoever's decided to use these cards to communicate with them, once you've charged them and given them the samadhi, they, nobody shouldn't just touch your cards. If you're doing a reading and you, they tell you cut the cards, okay, then that's in that moment, right? If they're doing a reading and they tell you shuffle the cards, okay, that's in that moment. Just walking in and touching somebody, no, 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 don't do that. You do not pick up my cards and read with my cards. You not go, not you please. This but th there's a respect level that you guys have got to have, right? These are your tools for your energies to communicate and build a relationship and a bond with you. Why would I want Joyce to come in here and touch my cards on an energy that I have built a relationship and a bond with that I need to feel her energy? Now Joyce don't come touch my cards, and now Joyce's funky, nasty, dusty energies on my cards. No, don't do that. So it's a little bit of etiquette and then this respect because your ladies is looking at you like I should punch her and you for letting me punch you first for letting her touch her. Who told you? Don't do that. Etiquette, respect, it's between you and her. These are ours. This is not for us to be sharing with them. Nobody else to be touching them. None of that other kind of stuff. If we're doing a reading and I say cut the cards, that's a different ball game. But for you to just be saying, oh, let me read your cards, bitch, don't touch my cards. I'll chop your fingers off. Every finger you'll lose on that hand. Don't touch them. Are you crazy? No.